Hi everybody, so today I'm going to alter a alarm clock layer shadow box here. I'm trading cutter circle inside my alarm clock. That paper is, I believe, authentic paper. I do not remember, I'm sorry. But I want to use that one uh, with the graphic 35. We got the one great white and black theme in my alarm clock. So and for this one, the script one is some graphic 45 paper. I think Mono Moon, I believe, if I say it right. So, yeah, I'm cutting a strip to a year dose around my alarm clock. And now time to, oh. At first, I thought I want to cover on the back, and then, you know. I end up, I didn't use it, I changed my mind. Now I just I saw my uh, edges of paper there, like a red ink pad. Now time to get my paper. You can use any uh, wet adhesive for the paper, that would be fine. So now I'm to burnish, make sure all oh my God, adhesive stick in there. Now I have to cover the paper around my arm clock. Sometimes with curved thing stuff, it can be challenging. It's take a little time to uh, cover that, but I do not want to uh, use it pain. It's, you know, pain and then just crackle, that's it, no option. But I love using the paper to cover around on the edges. Just make sure when you, uh, you, you know, when you glue it down, just burn it, make sure your paper stick into the project, that's it. Yeah, on the first one, I just, you know, want my piece go to underneath that, uh, what it's called, a uh, clock there. And I, the other one is the paper not gonna cover the whole thing like uh, 12 inches, so. I just want to make sure it's, the, no, the paper is just overlap, so I trim it off a little bit there. Now it's better. Don't forget to uh, coat with another your medium. E either with adhesive for the paper, that'd be fine. It's just your project lasts longer if you uh, coat with another your medium on the paper. So if you're not covered with your paper, like will you know start to peel off if you not seal with any medium and now I'm painting in white acrylic paint because I want to crackle this one either color that you want to crackle for your crack to see the bottom between you you that color so I'm painting in the front and in the back And now I'm using the uh, crackle medium there in the front and using black acrylic paint because as I said I'm going with a white black red theme. I recommend you guys do one at a time each time let it dry for do not do like I do that my mistake because um 
the charcoal medium if you use a little bit too much is is you have to lay it flat in order for your your effect to stay as it is but I stood up like that it's they have to tip over all the time to make my crackle not like dipping off and look weird now I'm cutting the picture of Cody there and using the, my wood frame there so make sure the paper not show up between the flourish frame there. So now I'm using adhesive to adhere with coated paper there. Now I'm thinking about using my lace around there. All pro trim. So I just assume the pro trim on the edge of the, the bottom there around the photo frame or around my alarm clock. And I'm using my black lace trim there around the edge at the top of the alarm clock there. I use a lot of my laces on my project. I think if uh, I don't use a lot of my laces on my project, a little bit, a little to give a night nice touch on it, I think it makes a lot of difference. I think if you use too much lace, I think it's too imp empowered. What do you call it? empower the uh, uh, project by itself? I think if you cover with lace too much, is you know only see a real truth of the product. Uh, you a little bit the same with the flower. If you use a little bit, it look a lot different. But if you use a lot of flower, you cover all the main focus points. I mean focal point. I am well. If you want to use for uh, you know focus on advertising flower, you can use a whole bunch. But for me and focus on you know alarm clock by so I don't use a lot so now I'm using try to use any flower spray on my there you little flower day and I get some light red spray there from the Hobby Lobby so from the Christmas section I thought I may use the whole thing but uh, it looked like too much Christmas theme so I just decided to use only the the red steam there Cut some off from the original spray. So now I'm hitting the flower. All the photo frame that I just painted red color paint. That's it. Sorry, I put too much talking. Now I'm adding some sentiment and small flower. I use some a little bit flower there. I think pretty much it. I'm done. Alright guys, that's it. Thank you everybody for watching and I hope you guys like it. Please leave your comment, give me a thumb up. We'll see you guys later. Bye bye.